Welcome back everybody. This is David from Bubblegum Cards and today we are going to be doing a random pack opening. We're going to do a little bit of baseball, Allen and Ginter um, 22 and then um, also some football, some certified 22. Um, I just stopped at my um, LCS today and I know it's been a while since we've done any kind of breaks. Obviously a lot of us <laughs> um you know, money's a little tight right now. So this, especially this time of year with Christmas coming up and stuff like that. So I couldn't afford a full hobby box, but I at least wanted to get, you know, another video out there. And if you guys notice straight in the back, this is the first video that we actually have our official logo out. Uh, my friend Alex did that logo. If you guys like it and maybe want a logo done for yourself, I can, if you, um, mention something in the comments or reach out, I can definitely put you in touch and he'd probably be happy to, to do the work. He's very, very good at it um, and very fast as well. So um, I'm not gonna waste a lot of time. Let's get right into it. Allen and Ginther 22, we'll do that one first. I, I've actually seen, this is one of those products that I think people kind of like gypsy queen it away. It seems like I like a lot of the weird stuff, but um, it's one of those products I think a lot of people are just kind of, turned off by just because they can have some really weird stuff in here. Like, um, I saw one the other day that had like a dinosaur bone relic in here. Um, but that's like one in, I don't know, several hundred thousand. Um, but that would be super cool if we can get something like that. And they also have a lot of like actors, um, any entertainment type famous people. I don't know if they've, I think they've had like presidents and stuff like that in here. Um, so we'll see what we get. We only got three packs today. So the chances are probably not with us doing that, but we'll see. I kind of like them. <laughs> and then some of these have, it's about cooking, diamond, crystal, kosher salt. <laughs> some of these have like interesting backs and stuff like that, but I like the feel of the cards. There, there's, it just feels more of like a retro um, paper kind of card. It's not like the glossy kind of new cards. Um, Cedric Mullins. There's Chris Hansen. Um, or <laughs> Chris Hansen. That's the guy from that one TV show. Scott Hansen. I think he's from NFL Network. Yeah, NFL Red Zone. See what I mean? They actually have people in here um, other than um, other than just baseball players. So that's kind of cool. Ooh, a nice Wander Franco. Not really sure who that is. Kate Brownell, CEO of Results Based Fitness. All right, never heard of her. Um, Riggle, I don't think he's on the NFL, the Fox NFL pregame show anymore. Uh, what do we got here? Sour Sop. <laughs> See what I mean? There's some really, uh, and then we have something about kosher salt. So just kind of out of the ordinary stuff. Let's see what we can get in pack two. Not off to the best start in the world. Maybe we'll get lucky, especially if you can get an autograph out of three packs. That Has there been a more disappointing player in baseball this year than this guy right here? Had him on my fantasy team a couple times, just hoping he would um, kind of take off, but never did. Verdugo, Willie McCovey, Tom Glavin, Brandon Marsh. Ooh, what's this card coming up? It's not gonna banner season. Ooh, banner season. Salvador Perez, 2015 World Series MVP. All right, what do we got here? These minis are cool too. Um, Max Scherzer. They just kind of give like a little nice little extra collectible feel to it. Now this one feels just a little bit thicker, so we'll see. It's probably gonna be a relic card if anything. <laughs> Jacob DeGrom on the back. He sure got paid, didn't he? I don't know if I would have gone five years. What do you guys think? Uh, would you go five years and a pitcher that's 35 and injury prone? He's very talented though, and pitching is hard to find, so I guess it's hard to say. All right. Nolan Arenado. They got Wilson Contreras too, the Cardinals did this week. Chipper Jones. I don't think we're going to get any hits in this one. But that's okay. That's how it happens sometimes. Sometimes it's just kind of cool to see the cards. Hendricks. Nope, no hits. 
Another uh, Cy Young Award, Jacob deGrom. Ooh, a Charlie Sheen. See what I mean? They have just entertainment um, people in there too. And I don't know if that's a special back or not. I'll have to flip through at the end. Um, but not all the backs are the same on these, so I'll have to go back through and take a look. All right, so that was Alan Ginter. Now we're on to certified football. So I'm hoping there's usually 10 packs in a box. We got three packs. Um, there's usually two autos and two mem cards. So I'm hoping we at least pull one um, hit out of this. I'd be disappointed if we didn't. The Alan Ginter, I wasn't really, um, wasn't really expecting anything out of there. And I can't even open the pack just like the other. There we go. I do without bending any corners here. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Damian Harris from the Patriots. Ooh, we got a number card in there. It's gonna be one of those 2022 um, basic insert cards, I think. Okay, Damian Harris, Dak Prescott. I don't know, I think he's a little overrated. Who is that, a Bosa? Oh no, it's Aiden Hutchinson from the Lions. Don't worry, we'll get these sleeved up. I just hate doing them um, as I'm filming. It just makes it tough. There's a Tua. He's having a good year. And then Joel Mixon. All right, so we're not doing so hot. We have one number card out of four packs here. Um, come on. There's got to be... Well, no, David Montgomery. Maybe that'll be uh, a little hint that there'll be a Justin Fields auto in here. <laughs> we could only wish. Um, Devonta Smith. Ooh, Devontae Smith. Ah, uh, well, it was an auto and it was a bear, but it was not the guy we were looking for. Kyler Gordon. Dang it. I saw the, you, a lot of times they do that when there's a bear um, or an NF, someone in the same division in the pack. Not bad. And it's number, ooh, numbered out of 99. So that's kind of cool. I think they're really nice looking cars. I'm gonna put them on this so I can get them sleeved up separately. Dark Horse is Mac Jones. I doubt that's gonna be numbered and I'm not sure. Um, I really should do more research ahead of time, but I just have fun kind of opening these. Just like you guys would, just going to the card shop and seeing. Oh, we'll see, I don't know if that one is worth anything. If you guys know, um, say something in the comments there. Josh Jacobs. And David Montgomery. All right, last pack. Let's hope for some last pack magic. I mean, we got our we got one autograph. So if we can pull um, a patch out of here, I would feel like. Oh my god! No, that's not. It's gonna be a filler. I know it is. I saw Justin Fields on the back. Oh, oh. I don't think that's a filler. All right, Brandon Cooks. I'm not going to, and as you guys have already figured out, I'm not going to make you guys wait to see the hits. I know a lot of those guys that are a little more experienced, a little fancier, they'll go with the two cars in the back. I'm just going to show you straight how you would open the pack, exactly what you would get. All right, but I am going to turn it the right way. Let's go down this way. Is that George Kittle? Please be a patch auto. Please be a patch auto. Please be a patch auto. No, it is not. Dang it. But it is a patch, so it could always be worse. Now, how chunky of a patch is it going to be? I'm going to say it's me one of those little small napkin patches, just like a one color patch. It's out of 50, so I mean, it could be worse. Ah, a little. These bigger cards are hard to. They look, 
you know, they always look like they're dented, but they're not really. It's just how thick they are. But anyways, we got a George Kittle. So we out of 10 packs, you get four hits. So we got two hits out of three packs. So I think we did pretty good on this one. Let's set him there. Um, Cooper Cup, Certified Stars, Derek Carr, and there's Justin Fields. So, I don't know. What do you guys think? This isn't numbered, no. I kind of like Certified. Um, hopefully this gave you a little taste of what to expect. Uh, like I said, the patch, that wasn't the best patch I've ever seen um, by any stretch of the imagination, but it was kind of cool. And I think this one said... Yeah, that's what you're looking for. Uh, it says player worn used material. Um, I think a lot of these end up saying the this um, is not from any game event or season. So at least this one says it's player worn. So um, I don't know. That'll add a little bit of value to it. I'm guessing this is like a $10 card, maybe a little bit more. Um, and I don't know much about Kyler Gordon. If you guys know anything, like I said, leave... And of course, it doesn't tell you anything about him. I have a friend um, that could tell me a lot about Kyler Gordon. I'm sure he's a big Bears fan. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you're digging the logo. Um, we'll try and get some more videos out um, as we go along. I know it was a while between the last one and this one. Um, and again, same thing I've said before. If you have any suggestions, uh, things that you would like to see again, you know, you'd have to keep it relative to a certain, you know, there's a budget here. <laughs> so, but give me some ideas. Do you, do you guys want to see retail or would you rather, I personally think that, um, it's more fun opening, even if I get six hobby packs versus like two retail blasters, because the odds of getting hits are so much higher, um, this way. So, but let me know what you think. And like I said, if you have any ideas, um, let me know. And I'm definitely open to suggestions and trying new things. And we're going to um, try and have as much fun as we can. And I'll try and show you guys as, as much of the new product as I possibly can. Um, so hopefully you get a chance to see if you like it before you have to run over, you know, to your hobby shop and, and purchase some packs or boxes or stuff like that. So, all right. Well, I appreciate it. I hope you guys have a good night. Take care.